Hello and welcome. There are many screen resolutions used by different devices. Some of the leading screen resolutions or mobile devices are 480 by 800, 720 by 1280, 1080 by 1920, and many more. Which means these screens do not all have the same scale factor. The scale factor is calculated by dividing the screen height by the screen width. For example, a screen with a resolution of 480 by 800 has a scale factor of around 1.6 and that of 720 by 1280 and 1080 by 1920 is around 1.7. The canvas scalar component is used to control the overall scale and pixel density of UI elements in the canvas. We have a parent game object in the scene named Game Manager with a canvas and a canvas scalar components. All that is needed on other child canvas game objects is a canvas component with a pixel perfect property set to inherit. On the canvas component of our parent game object, set the render mode to space screen camera and set the render camera to the scene's main camera. Then on the canvas scalar component, we set the UI scale mode to scale with screen size. Let's use a resolution of 1080 by 1920 as a reference resolution. Leave screen match mode at match width or height. Matching with width or height means the width or height of the screen will be used to determine the overall screen resolution respectively. Depending on the screen resolution, we need to match either the width or the height to get all our game objects appearing on the screen. Our reference resolution has a scale factor of about 1.7. When the screen resolution scale factor is greater or equal to the scale factor of the reference resolution, then we'll match the width. But when it is less than the scale factor of the reference resolution, then we'll match the height instead. And so all that is needed is, at the start of the game, check the current resolution and calculate its scale factor. Compare the result to the scale factor of the reference resolution and set the screen match accordingly. We have our script named game script, which is attached to the game object game manager. It has a variable referencing the canvas scalar component. Then in the start function, the current scale factor of the screen is calculated using the screen height and screen width. Remember to avoid integer division. Make sure the screen height and width values are converted to floating point values before you divide. Now see the result when we enter play mode. We have come to the end of this tutorial. Please subscribe to this channel for more videos. Thank you.